Hey guys, how are you going today? Um, welcome to episode three of, of our special series of Kitchen Table to GP, where um, Elliot and myself play Magic. Um, we record our matches um, every Tuesday night. And uh, we're gonna just go over a little recap of what happened last week. Uh, there was no major tournaments, but we did play a Gamers Guild this Friday night at the Modern FNM. Funny thing is, both of us got on stream. Elliot got on stream for round two, and I had got on stream for round three. So Elliot, why don't you talk about your match that was on stream? I played against Merfolk, or no, not Merfolk, uh, Merktide. Mm -hmm. And I, we both had one game and we were going into round three, game three. Um, and I had him at three and he had, he had me at 10. He had exactly 10 power on the board, and I had only lands, and I was top decking. If I drew a burn spell, I could have won the game, and I drew an Arid Mesa. Then he killed me next turn, because he put down Merktide, and just killed me. And then I played uh, round three of the stream, and I played a four-color zoo deck that the commentators were going bonkers over. I might as well have not, I shouldn't have been on match because the, my, that deck was just getting all the praise during the match. Uh, I got destroyed. Um, and there really wasn't those of us to cover. So, but I will actually leave a link um, to the stream in the description if you guys want to go check that out. Go check out the Gamers Guild stream. That's what, that's the local game store Ellie and I play at every Friday. Um, so today we're actually going to be playing the decks that we played on stream. So Elliot will be playing his version of Burn. I think it's the same version that he's been playing with for since... Five years? No, it's been since for the past two weeks. It's the last version that you played at um, the uh, Tucson City Champions uh, two weeks ago. And I'm playing uh, Death and Taxes, but I'm playing a little bit of a different version. I took out um, Archon of Remiria, uh, a land, and a Skyclave Apparition I put in for Esper Sentinels have actually worked out really well because the extra card draw has been really helpful with all the cheap non-creature spells in Modern. And I switched up the sideboard a little bit, so all my creatures are, are, are sorry, so all my cards are creature cards except for the four Aether Vials and the three equipments that I can uh, fetch out for Snow Forge. And his deck name. Yeah, so my deck name was 86,000 IRS Agents. And if you've been following the news, you get what that references. All right, so shall we do high roll? Yes. Right. I have the D20. You have the D20 to D20? Yes. All right. I'll call it God. It's even. All right. You go I first. I thought we were doing high roll, but okay. Nope. When you have the one dies, it's better to do odd or even. It's it's a 50% chance of winning. Yeah, I'll take the play. Okay, so Ali's going to take the play. You're Did not going you to shuffle. You should already shuffle. I didn't shuffle these. We shuffle, we're going to shuffle on camera. Oh, so I thought you already shuffled. Shuffle. Nope. And by the way, last, wait, did I have all four Modern Series Swift Spears? No, Elliot also upgraded his deck. He got the Borderless Monastery Swift Spears from Double Masters. So. Instead of the non-Borderless. Yeah, non he had one non, he had one Borderless and then he had three from Iconic Masters. So we switched out all the, uh, cause I actually went three and one. I ended up going three and one at FNM last week and you went two and two. Yeah. So we used some of my winnings to upgrade his deck. It must be nice, huh? Yes. Yeah, Okay, all right, let's get this Wait a minute. game started. Where's my dick? Why did my dick upset me? Mm. What are you gonna do? Are you decided you're gonna keep her mulligan. Yeah, I'll try this. Hmm, this hand is very interesting. Same. It's very, very, very. I'm actually gonna mulligan. I don't think I have that hand. Why are my sleeves like being so weird and they're like not getting these like black dots? 
because it's dirt. Because we've been using them a lot. Once they once you shuffle, we get a little bit of dirt on them. So I guess I'm gonna be cleaning mine off. Spreading water on it. Keep it. Going five. Ooh, I went to one. Yeah, I'm telling the story why I went to one. Um, I was playing Living End, and I went to one because I um, put in Rest in Peace, but the first hand had Rest in Peace, but I didn't have any lands to play Rest in Peace, and I didn't, so I didn't play that hand, and then I drew next, and too many lands, too many creatures, too many lands, too many creatures, too many lands, too many creatures, and I finally got it. All right, I'm just gonna keep this. Unfortunately, on the five, I'm putting that back. And that. All right. Ready? Yep. Inspiring Vantage. Tap that and get a Swiss ear in. Attack for one. Right. Down to nineteen. My turn. Your turn. Upkeep draw. Feel the ruin. Go ahead. Can't you just like destroy it and land? No, that's gross quarter. Send them going. On tap, drop, land, I'll fetch. Okay, go, to that. go down to 17. 17. Not a fetch shot because I don't like fetch shopping. It's not fun. It's shop. Don't need to fetch shop. Oh, yeah. My favorite land probably is probably like. Canyon because it's a land, but you get to drop cards off of it. Yeah, those are from the those are from the horizon cycle from Modern Horizons One. Since land came in, let's go. You pay the extra one for it. Yeah. Okay. Should I take three? Yeah. Two, three. And I'll take. That's why I kept the Nine. hand. <gasps> Your turn. Keep draw. Ghost quarter. Can't you just destroy my lands? No. I'm going to float a colorless what? and a white. No. This is going to represent colorless and a white. I'm actually going to ghost quarter my field of ruin. Got another planes. Wait, so I can float mana? Yes. And tap them? Yes, you can respond. So when you, in response to a gorse quarter or a wasteland, you can float wasteland's legacy. So you can float mana. So, so I could have like, when you ghost quarter my lands, I can just float? Yep, and then I will yes. do another white. Then I'll use one of the whites to play a giver. Are you playing? And then colorless and white to play Leon Arbor and then pass you. Are you playing Death and Taxes or are you playing Storm? I'm playing, I had no good lands <laughs> and I had to mold a five, so that's what I'm playing. Um, yeah, I'm gonna go ahead. Bet. Nope, you have to pay two now because Leon Arbor. What do you mean? Any players? Players can't search libraries. Any time, any player may pay two and search the libraries later in the turn. I'm I'm mad right now. Okay. That's really disappointing. Let's play an Idolone. Okay, Idolon. Oh boy. And it's your turn now. Okay. Upkeep. Draw. Land. Land and spells take two. Draw. Land. Monastery Sphere. 
So you take two from that. Down to two, okay. Three. Strength damage. Yep. One, two, three, and down to six. Swing. Four. Two, two. So for four? Mm hmm. Block here before damage. I'll give a protection for red and I'll take two. Smart idea. In the four? Your turn, yes. I might kill you next turn. Spells are spells. Not spells. Equal no spell. They that's do. Percent, no? They do. Oh, yeah, that's right. I take Now oh, anything can kill you. Pretty much. All right, go ahead. Draw. Oh gosh. Oh, this is really painful. I'm gonna have to hard guess this here. You're targeting me. Mm -hmm. All right. Yo, that's um, that's lucky. Game that's more. really that lucky. Was not a, that was not a good showing by Death and Taxes there. Ooh. All right, sideboard time. Ura, ura. I really don't know what to put in. Ura, ura. I might, um, basic death and taxes. Burn. Da da da. da. Everything that you play is like, I honestly don't know what to take out. Wait, well, how much am I putting in? Yeah, you better figure out what you're putting in before you, before you take out. Seven? Am I? So on death and taxes side, I'm taking up like four Leonard Arbors. Searching doesn't really uh, phase burn too much. And then I'm gonna put in two Cathark Commandos. And I actually have upgraded my sideboard to include uh, three bird force tenders, which is great. Protection from red. And then I can sacrifice it to prevent uh, damage from a red source. And I'm just gonna bring in an, an extra expa uh, extra extraction specialist because it has lifelink and I can get uh, creature out of the sideboard. And like I said, I take out two Plisco Risps and three Leon Armors. The Plisco Risp I don't think is really great in this matchup. And plus being one toughness, it uh, it can dive pretty easily to some birds with us. It's Flicker Wisp. Um, and um, what I put in is one Warrant here, one Smash to Smithering, because that's the only artifact. I put in Path to Exile because of the um, living weapons. So I can just path the, which one we call it? Token. Yeah. I put in rolling for kickers for to stop him gaining life and for him to take damage because damage is very crucial with death and taxes. And I only have to pay three and it's just a free one damage. And I know that he doesn't have any enchantment killer. So what are you taking out? Um, and what I'm taking out is the whole play set of Rift Bolts. Because okay. I don't want to wait and it casts more. Um, I took out two Eidolons and I took out one Skewer the Critics. I took out the Eidolons, um, it's because I'm, my dad makes smart decisions. Okay, so look at your sideboard, how many, how many are you bringing in? Seven. How many are you taking out? Seven. Two, three, four, five, six, seven. Oh. So you need to figure out some of this thing out. I'm going to take out, um, so much gear. All right. All right, I'll take the play. Hopefully you'll actually get a second game of Magic there. That first game was, uh, that was a non-game. That was like my that was like my uh, experience on stream. <laughs> and then also, um, so this coming weekend, there's an RCQ, a modern RCQ at Phoenix Gaming Lounge. Is one of, Phoenix Gaming Lounge is one of the first places I started playing at when I got back into Magic. Um, so it's going to be uh, a RCQ, which is a map to the Pro Tour. So we'll be playing in that this this Saturday, and then after that. Um, is going to be the uh, Arizona Masters uh, 2023 qualifier, 
that's going along with the 2022 Masters Invitational. So that's the uh, like sub tournament for people who didn't qualify for the Masters this year. Who can get a if you win it, you can get an invite to the um, Masters 2023 Invitational. So that's kind of what we're doing um, for our uh, next. magic activities the next few weeks. And uh, next video we'll probably recap what I'm on the RCQ and what we played. Um, Elliot's probably going to play Burn. We're probably going to switch up his sideboard a little bit. Uh, we don't know what we're going to do yet. And I haven't decided what I'm playing yet. I might play Scape Ship, Death and Taxes, or Yagma. But I haven't played Yagma in a while. But he used to be so good at it. Yeah, I'm not. I'm still pretty good at it. I just haven't played it. I don't know. I just haven't been really high on it. Or not. I'm just not, not high on it. You need an offer cut. An offer into it. Not being into it. All right. Um... Okay, I'll keep him his hand. Yes, challenging one. Yeah, I'll keep this one. Too. Okay, ready? Yeah. Go ahead, file. Blanche. Three to me. One, two, three. Here we go. Five key. Eight the rail trigger. I'll draw. Let's go ahead and land return. Two. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Go ahead. Wait, non-creature spells? Mm -hmm. Oh wait, you have to draw yeah, first. Yeah. Yes. Eidolon. Okay. Give you the turn. At your end step, activate. Give it. Oh, sorry, wrong way. <laughs> for force tender. Okay. Upkeep. Trigger. Draw. Combat. Two. First strike. Okay, no blocks, take the damage. I'll pass. I'll play a canyon. Game one. Don't take two. Or take three. Don't fourteen. Take one. So take three. And scary. Federal level. Any target. Oh wait. Oh, you had to pay the extra for the not for Thalia. Oh boy, we missed those. All right, that's on us. And that's on me. I missed it. I'm gonna kill the Thalia instead. Are you gonna kill the Thalia instead? Yeah, that's what I said. But you still have to pay the one extra one because you already paid because for the lightning helix. I should have. So you had to pay. You had to pay the. Yeah. So do you wanna take? Well, you took one. Yeah. Just game two. Oh wait, no. Yeah, you still have to take because of the. Um, goblin. Yep. I want this to die so bad. Spin for four. Four outlets of the Goblin God trigger resolve. It doesn't really matter. Which All right, land goes to my hand, um, and then I'm just gonna block the Goblin Guide and take two. We're nine. Mhm. Mm my turn. Yeah. Take turn step. Activate. Stoneforge. Yeah. I can still probably kill you somehow. Okay, let's, let, 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 let's, let's figure that out. Do you have it in your hand? Sorry, fire and ice. Oh, fire and ice sword thing. You're gonna give it to Sully. Yeah. Right. Option cut. Uh, tap. Tap, all right, I'll, I'll keep. Yes. Up to three. And mm. activate. But you can't equip it yet. Oh, whoops. Game's first. 
make all sorts of mistakes in this game. Batter skull will play. And then I'm going to activate um, and Rob. Is it target pin on the board? What's that? Is it target? No, it's just uh, I, get, I get to activate creature card. Creature card from my play. Sky click. I'll take the uh, I'll take the. Uh, you have to take damage. No, I don't because it's it's not casting. It's coming from my hand. Got it. Yep. Uh, combat. Ooh, it's in my hand. Swing for uh, three. Uh, go ahead. Attack. Dad, you might have just ended your game. Okay. Wait, is the Thalia still on the board? Yes, she is. Fetch. Okay, got Jake's well. I might actually win here. So be pretty scared, Dad. Okay. Be very scared. Ah, ah. Why do I do this? I'm stumbling. You brought the board. Are you gonna cut? No, I'll tap it. <sighs> no! Oh, can you stop with the random noises? Fine. Thank you. I just look at your phone. Tap. The picture might just hit on you. It's like lands all over the place. Hmm. So I'm going to Lightning Bolt Thalia. Okay. Hmm. Take one. Gain three. All right, who are you targeting with the Lightning Dice? You. Ah. Three, that was six. Two, that was three. I'll pass. Okay, upkeep. I'm to not going to tick that up. Land for turn. It might actually kill me. Uh, put the sword fire dice on the ground on the battlefield. Mm-hmm. Equip it. Equip it to the batter skull. I will attack for uh, six. Vigilance, um, lifelink, and protection from red and blue. I will do the, the two damage. I'll do to the Goblin Guide. I'll draw a card. That. That. And I will... Wait, so the creature can't be targeted? Yeah. But you Just can kill... The you can kill... Yeah, the creature, but you can kill the equipment. So technically the creature has protection, but you can kill the bat... Like a batter skull and the... Um, oh, yeah. Yeah. All right. Um, so I will... Um, Attack and then pass. All right, I'm going to pass to you. So, first of all, lands. Smash the smithereens, hit the batter skull. A response to the batter skull target. Activate. Mm -hmm. Bring a flicker wisp. I'm going to flicker the batter skull. Mm -hmm. So this will go away. This will drop off. So this will come back in my hand and step. Mm -hmm. So that fizzles. Yeah. On my turn? Yes. Take one. Your gift. Okay. That just ruined and, my day. Oh. Um, and stop. I try to stop. This comes back. My turn? Yeah. Okay. I'll keep. Okay. This back here. What are you at? You're at seven? Mm hmm. Game Frick. three. I could have won next turn. I had a. Well, you um, said you were gonna win that one turn, and you didn't. So you got. Yeah, cause you, you fit. Um, cause um, I thought I had a line, but I didn't. Okay. Cause I tried to. Um, if I drew a spell, then I would have won. All right, you have the play kill. Yes. That is scary for you. Yes, it is, cause usually Burn wants to play. Burn wants to play.
Good luck on the last game. Yes. I mean, it's a risk. It's a really risky move. Oh, Dad, we missed something. We what forgot we to gain the life off the batter spool. Oh, yeah, but it didn't matter. Yeah, I, you still would have won. Yeah. It didn't We're forgetting a lot of life gain triggers here. Hence, live TV, live YouTube. We're just playing, we're playing a little fast and loose today is what we like to call it. I'm going to actually mull again, that's not a good <laughs> I'm laughing at everything today for some reason. It's going to six. Oh, my eye's so itchy. Keep this hand, and I will send. Uh, Sam, I'll keep this hand. Yes. I will send this back. Okay, your turn. Ready? Yep. Two trigger. I played an inspiring vintage, and I. Goblin guy trigger mm -hmm. skyclave apposition off the top. Apparition uh, apposition apparition. Now we can. Now you can actually right. see the cards. Yep. All right. Upkeep. Draw the apparition he knows about. Mm -hmm. I land for turn. Eat the vial. That's for seven. Go ahead. Two goblin guides. Should I waste it? Nah. Huh. That's. Remember, every time I draw a card, so, Four. all right. Four, trigger, first trigger. Eat the vial. Second trigger. Eat the vial. Look on top. Um, I'm gonna take four. Oh yeah. Two, three, four, no blocks. Down to 14. Here you go. Upkeep, draw. Land for turn. Thalia? Nope. Thalia? Um, Thalia? Yeah, we'll go with Thalia. Ah! Uh. Pass, and uh, pass to you. That's the fact that you know you messed up. Do you want to pay the extra one for the, uh... Okay, what, what are you, who are you targeting? Oh, yeah, right. Um, I will search for a land. I'll search for a land. And then while you're doing that, I'll swing for... Okay. That's gonna be pretty crucial. Okay. Now that's gonna be pretty crucial. Okay, so he's paid the one so far. Why am I so tired? Okay. Option cut. I mean, I did like take a shower thirty minutes ago. Or how long ago the video started? I will. Um. I'll. Hmm. I'll block one. I'll take okay. Two. One, two. All right. My turn. <gasps> yeah. I'll keep draw. Tectonic edge for turn for land for turn. Hard cast. Um, Clave. I'll take one of the goblin guides. And then I'll play Vile pass to you. You're on my card. I got just what I wanted. I could have killed you this turn. Okay. Land? I forgot to untap there. Deal three to the Skyclave. Okay. Wait, does it have summoning three, sickness? Three. The Skyclave? Yeah, no. Yeah. The the creature that I'm gonna get. Yes, it does. So this goes in exile, and then you're gonna get a one one blue. Um, I'll fetch. Okay. Blue and then we'll make Okay. 
This one is not looking good for my dad. Are you kind of worried? Yeah, I mean, yeah. You could lose. There's I mean, a possibility. Yep. Yeah. Forgot to put those in. I mean, I know it's a stone forge, so. Colorless, no white. Charming print, I'll gain three life. Yeah, that was definitely. Pretty, that was pretty that obvious was. on that one. And then stone forge, I'll search. Four. And then I'm going to pass to you. Draw with the untap. Batter scroll in hand. Lance. Let's sack my eyelid. Uh, um, hmm. I'll pass. Okay. Oop. <laughs> Just a hand. Probably right. gonna cast. Upkeep. Move it up to two. Draw. Good. Giver? Yep. I'll pass. Untap. Draw. Spike. Draw three. No. Smashing this? Yes. Game. Oof. Oof. That is scary. Alright. Well, Death and Taxes did not win that one. Oof. I am currently only lost once. Yeah, you lost episode one. To Death and Taxes. To Death That's and taxes. my revenge. Yep. Revenge. Alright, guys. Uh, thanks for watching. Once again, uh, hopefully you've made it to the end. If you have, make sure you like, uh, sub, and um, comment. comment below and thank you for watching and we will uh, be back next week with episode 4. And see ya! See ya! Peace!